default pose for the arms will depend on production requirements. We modeled the arms in standard T-pose and now we'll readjust them to rest at about a 45 degree angle. Snap cursor to selected. The hotkeys to switch the pivot point from 3D cursor to default are period and comma on the keyboard. Adjusting the proportional influence and ensuring the torso isn't affected. Rotating the arms and also dropping them a bit. Paying close attention to maintaining the arm length. This is a gradual process and we'll start out looking a bit rough. Taking into consideration how the back muscles and bones realign and shift when arms move up and down. Cleaning up the geometry with subsurf off. and reshaping the overall form. using the object mode undo and redo from original T-pose to 45 degrees. Adjusting the silhouette of the shoulders. We'll also rest the fingers a bit, using Alt-B to box cut, cursor to selected, adjusting the scale for the proportional edit brush,
toggling between pivot points. Increasing the influence of the bend into the hand. and ensuring the overall proportions of the fingers are maintained. Alt B to toggle out of box cut view. Reviewing the overall progress. Defining a more angular shape at the thumb base. using the references for some adjustments. Adjusting the eyelash material. Reworking the eyelashes and shaping them out a bit more. Finalizing the body and adding another span in the upper arm for better definition. <laughs> 